Hello, Andrew Lynch here, and today is the number one way that you can lower your golf scores is drum roll. You have to change the way you think. And you're thinking, oh God, I wanted it to be a move, a magic move, or Hogan's secret. Well, I've done videos on what was Hogan's secret, check them out. And the fact of the matter is that Hogan didn't start improving till he gave up on having a perfect golf swing. Yes. So when you play in your monthly medal or whether you're watching the British Open, the uh, at the moment, and uh, I think Colin Morikawa is leading about nine under here on Friday afternoon. One thing is that oh, the winner of the British Open and the winner of this week's monthly medal at Diddley Squat Golf Club is he's going to manage his game, he's going to manage his mind and his swing is what it is. On any given day you wake up with a draw, a slice, a fade and you play for it. If your first couple of shots are fades, play a fade all the way round. Don't try and play a draw when it's a fade day. Uh, Lee Trevino made over 30 million for fade. Uh, and the golf card, as I've said many times, is brutal. All it wants is a number. And so when we turn up for our monthly medal, don't be bothered if your swing is a, is a little bit laid off and it's not up here and you don't feel you're compressing the ball enough. What's the score? What score are you going for? Do you really need to try and hit a 320 yard drive like the club champion you're playing with on a medium par 4? Or actually, can you just like hit iron iron? You know, let him play his game, you play your game. It's in the mind, we lose it in the mind. Was it Walter Hagen? The hardest six inches between the ears. And that's where the game is won and lost. It's not won and lost because you haven't got a perfect, perfect golf swing. Because the British Open at the moment is full of players, elite players, with less than perfect golf swings. When Darren Clark won his British Open, he said to Pete Cowan on the, on the morning of the first round, I'm playing crap. I don't stand a chance. And do you know what? He rolled in a couple of putts, he got his confidence up, and the same swing that was crap won him his only major. So, I'm not going to be showing you any kind of like, there's a, one golf shot there right at the start, that's actually my second swing of the day. I've been working on my uh, Alfa Romeo uh, and cutting the grass, so I'm a little bit stiff, but that's my second swing of the day. And all I was trying to do was swing the golf club. And if I've got a card in my hand, I'm then swinging the golf club to get a score. Not bothered what anybody else does. Uh, and you know, it's not the lack of 50 yards off the tee that's stopping you from being a better player. This week again, we've seen uh, Bryson there hitting 360 yard drive, but he can't stop the ball on the green. So what's the point? Let him play his game, you play your game. And the thing is, I always say, you know what, I look at the card and I say, where do I want to be? I want to be 240 off the tee, go 240 off the tee. Don't think you've got to use driver. Don't think you've got to do anything else than get a score. And it doesn't matter how you do it. You know, you hold your third shot from the fairway because you was in a fairway bunker and you hold it, it's a three on a par four. That's all the card wants, is the number. So the number one way to lower your golf scores is to change the way you think. And if you change the way you think, you will change your golf swing because that's how I change golf swings. I don't change it by teaching positions. I teach it by the way you think. So, you know, the guy who, who is kind of like, like this, it's, he knows he should be taking it back further, but it's this that's stopping him. So, work on your mind. 
What are you thinking about on the first team that monthly medal? Are you thinking the score? Or are you thinking about, oh, you know, make sure my wrists are this, or make sure... That's not going to help you. That was for the practice range. That was for the back garden, wherever. But it's not for the first tee. First tee is about getting a score, and you get it anyhow. As Tycho often said, a win is a win. Doesn't matter how you do it. I mean, when he won his 15th major, he kind of limped over the line there with a bogey on the 18th. Is anybody talking about that when you're picking up the green jacket and a couple of million dollars? No, a win is a win. So your biggest problem is yourself. For me, it's myself and it's my mind. So how I manage my mind and how I manage my expectations and how I punish myself if I hit a bad shot all determine my score. So, next time you're out picking a golf club up, oh, next time you're out playing a round of golf, play the card. If you've got 16 shots, that means you can have 16 bogeys, two pars. Just aim for bogeys. Most 16 handicappers are aiming to par every single hole. Well, they wouldn't be off 16 if they could do that, could they? So. Again, it's all in here, and I think we're going to cover a little few more videos on this, but this week, being British Open week, the Open victor, the champion for 2021, is going to be the guy, not with the best swing, it's going to be the guy who manages his mind and manages his game. So if you want to win the British Open, or you want to win your monthly medal, or just that four guys rolling up with ten dollars or a pound in or whatever if you just want to win it it's how you manage your game your mind and one of the ways i always do that is basically focus on what's important so what's important is my target harvey Pennick. take dead aim you know what i mean because when you're thinking about the target your mind will then instruct the brain how to do the swing so you know think about your target think about what you want to do i think that one of the best ever of that was sefi Ballesteros. he could picture it and make it happen and uh, you will score better so from andrew lynch revealing the not so secret secret of how to get a lower score the number one way is improve your mind, improve your thinking, and you will score lower. So, any questions on how you can do this or you're not sure about it, get back to me. Please press the like and subscribe, and let's keep the love going. And let's see if Colin can become the Open Champion. Uh, that wouldn't be bad, would it? Take care. Till next time.